Rose! Ice tried to take Oscar before the battle from me, bro. Damn. So I wanted to make sure that I looked it up right. And I, you, they can't deport you if you are in the process of becoming a citizen. So just in case Ice is here, he's in the process, y'all. So. <laughs> Look like you got Parkinson's, this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Ruben, Ruben actually was born here, uh, which is lucky for him, man, because if he ever tried to cross the border, his fat ass wouldn't be able to cross the fence and shit. Like, <laughs> he will get stuck in the motherfucking tunnel and shit. <laughs> Oscar is so Mexican and lazy that he's Venezuelan. <laughs> Communist. All right, I'll go with that, man. Uh, Health care for everyone, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I love you, bro. <laughs> Ruben looks like he wanted to be a pedophile, but every time he bought candy for the children, he would just eat it first. Like, he tried to chase them, but even the crippled ones would outrun him and shit. <laughs> Oscar has a lazy guy that works harder than him. Oh. He's looking at you and me right now, yo. I get to be a lazy Venezuelan, bro. You guys take care of me, motherfucker. My <laughs> daughter, Ruben is so fat and ugly. <laughs> that every time he plays strip poker, when he loses, they make him put more clothes on and shit. He always ends up with like four jackets and three beanies and shit. It sounds like the shit that you had to pick up from Goodwill, dog. Yeah. Uh, Oscar is so broke that he prays to God that Donald Trump gets reelected so he can get a free ride back home to Mexico. Make America great again, by the way. Not that way. <laughs> Ruben. <laughs> Ruben looks like. <laughs> Ruben looks like Yolanda Saldivar with beard and shit. Bro. He got death threats because he killed Selena and shit. <laughs> That's for the Mexicans. I don't know. <laughs> We gotta make our juice joke universal, bro. Yeah, we gotta make a white joke, uh -huh. Mexican joke. White joke, Mexican joke. Let that happen. Oscar looks like... Oscar looks like is uh, what... Uh, on Webster's Dictionary, when you look up incest, baby. <laughs> All right, he's a, he's a white joke. Um, <laughs> what joke, what joke <laughs> he's a, um, Ruben. Ruben bought the Kama Sutra because he thought it was an Indian cookbook. <laughs> he looked at it and was like, wait, this is not how you make curry. <laughs> Oscar's day job is over, and I had to think it. I'm like, the only way he's ever to drive over if he borrows his roommate's car and his social security <laughs> number. <laughs> that works. Uh, somebody got to walk The only the way you do Uber is you got the fucking bass door attached to it so you could come in and shit. <laughs> I didn't say that right. Uh, <laughs> nothing you say is right, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, bro. <laughs> Get him in Glessin Barrera, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I speak too late, yeah, yeah. Well, it's very good, man. Ruben, as you can tell, is so anti-cardio. <laughs> that if this room was to burn down, he would rather stay here and die than run outside and shit, bro. Hey, besides all this bullshit, man, you're an inspiration, bro. He's currently led Mexico's Special Olympic team. <laughs> to the gold medal for stolen catalytic converters. Give it up, everyone. <laughs>
and you let Mexico plus size team do what? How you joking? That's six. You got one more? Yeah, I got one more. I think we got one more, right? I don't, but let's do it. Right all right. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um, Ruben bombed at a brewery last night. That's bogus. <laughs> <laughs> The last time I saw Ruben being funny was when he was stealing one of Ken Flores' jokes. Woo! He wants to be like Ken Flores so much, it looks like he ate Ken Flores. <laughs> All right, that's Come it. Come on, Ruben! <laughs> that was gay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, give it up for that. <laughs> Holy shit. That was gay. That was great. Come on, give it up for these two. Great job. Also, that was fucked up because I, I was at that brewery show. But uh, I probably was. He didn't bomb. He did fine. But, you know, give him, well, I want to start with Nathan. What did you think of this battle up here, man? Uh, obviously, Ruben, you were born here, Mexican Grimace. Um, which is kind of disappointing, Oscar. You, I, I, I love you, dude, but you just lean too heavy on him being heavy, man. So I got to go with Ruben. Yeah. Okay, Ruben gets a vote. Yeah. Yes. Ruben. Tito. This shit makes me mad that I'm Mexican. Uh, <laughs> uh, we got one guy with a Middle Eastern haircut and the other one just gets the Chinese. <laughs> if you guys are here, who's picking up metal in my alley? Anyways. <laughs> Let's go. They don't work. Shut up. Uh, shut up, stupid. Uh, damn, what a, what a great battle for both of you. Both had bars, uh, the candy joke. The Venezuelan lazy Mexican, fucking A. You had uh, Inglesi Barrera's uh, deep cut in there. Uh, that was fucking fantastic. Oscar, you had some good ones, but I think at the end, for me, it was Ruben, just by a little bit. Just by a little bit. Super Ruben, Super Ruben. Hell yeah, fantastic. Give it up for Zanies, everybody. Woo! For letting these guys take a break from the kitchen to do this. Uh, <laughs> I like that was fire. Bro. <laughs> I like Oscar's Aztec haircut. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, Oscar's family built Mana I think. Uh, I love both you guys. Uh, Ruben got it all day. Okay, Ruben, three. He wins. They give it up for Ruben. I do want thoughts from Jessica. You guys are both shaped like upside down Modelo bottles. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't believe one was calling the other fat. <laughs> this was great, this was super good. I felt like it was really close. Oscar, you had some great ones that like Venezuelan joke that I did not understand. <laughs> but I knew when to laugh and that was important. <laughs> Uh, but Ruben, I really felt like you took it. Um, this was like a battle of who could grow a beard, and Ruben can. <laughs> Ruben's beard gets a vote. I do want final thoughts from the bearded man himself, Kevin Callum. You know who I'm voting for? The Mexican. That's who I'm voting for. <laughs> Uh, no, in all honesty, uh, I, I thought Ruben had him by an inch, but also, Ruben, you said that he won the catalytic converter competition, right? You can't get underneath the fucking car, dude. What are you talking about? You need him to tie your shoes before you go home tonight, you know what I mean? I'm going with Ruben, but give it up for Oscar as well. All right, these two are monsters, man. Great job, great job. Hey, thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago. If you guys want to subscribe to our channel, you get even more content, a bunch of it, hours of it for free. And you can hit that little like button down there, hit the subscribe right over here, and check out these videos right over here.